Hi, my name is Danya and I'm a first year commerce student at McMaster. Hi, I'm Sonia and I'm a life science student. And today we're just going to be doing like a quick room tour of our residence in PGCLL. Okay, so here's my desk area. You have an amazing view of campus and the forest. I don't really keep my school supplies in the store, but you can if you want. Over here we have the bed area underneath. The good thing about these beds, they're really high up, so you have like lots of space to put like your clothes, so you can get like bins and stuff. And my laundry area. So for my bedding, I actually got it from Amazon. The LED lights as well are from Amazon. They're super affordable if you can get them online. And then I got this from HomeSense. For like my photos and stuff, I got this cork board thing from Walmart and I just put a bunch of photos of my friends. Okay, so here's our closet area. And then I like to keep like my books on these shelves and a bunch of like skincare products, towels, and yeah. And then we have a bunch of drawers. I have my snack drawer here. If you want to get more space, you can get these stuff that I got from Ikea. So you can put like your clothes and like your jeans. And, and then on top we have like a shelf that you can put like shoes, scarves, whatever you need. I recommend getting like those sturdy command hooks. So this is my closet area. I did the same thing as Sonia. I got like the, what are these called? Cubbies. Cubbies type stuff over here. I just have my like books and stuff and I brought a box to put my uh, bathroom supplies, the drawers, I just brought like, you know, um, medical stuff, first aid, and like, this is all my food and utensils. I have um, a hook for my jacket and, and then for the desk drawer, I just decided, I decided to put like all my papers, important like um, animal labels and where I decided to decorate the wall. <laughs> Most of the decoration that I got were from the poster sale. I think they happened like three times already. So all my posters. And then this is just like art stuff with like photos of my family and friends that I have. And for the bed, um, again, I put my suitcase here and like a few of my bags. And then I also got like this a uh, drawer to act as my nightstand and I don't really put much in here but it's just like in case I needed to have extra stuff. So my roommate and I decided to rent a fridge through Coldex so this is where we just keep all our food and stuff and then we decided to get our own toaster and kettle that we use in the kitchen. We have our own washrooms in PGCLL. So we have double sinks because we're sharing with the room next door. So that's good, we each have our own space. And then in here we have our own shower. So it's good that you can like lock it. So when someone's taking a shower, you can still be using the washroom. And then same with the toilet, you can lock the door and still be using the washroom. So it's really spacious, but I do recommend bringing bins underneath because there's no, um, drawers so that's one thing we didn't know before moving in here so when you're moving into PG I really recommend getting like silicone boxes because obviously we were the first ones moving in here so we had no idea how it was gonna like look so we mm. thought we were gonna have like drawers under our bed and our like washrooms so yeah getting silicone boxes to put your stuff that you can put under your bed and under the sink is like really important if you do have a roommate, talk to each other about like what you can bring before moving. Cause like okay. I remember like we talked to each other. I brought like the toilet brush and all that. Yeah. Stuff. So like we share a washroom with um two other, two, girls. Two other girls over two there, girls and girls, yeah. um what we do is like we have like an organized schedule of like who cleans every week. So like the first week I clean and then it's her and then like we all just like organize and there's usually no conflict so it's yeah. important with your roommates to make like a contract mm -hmm. a roommate agreement so everyone knows what they're doing yeah. and yeah you don't need to bring everything during move-in mm -hmm. my mistake during move-in was bringing every single thing I need every single clothes especially since it's during the summer mm -hmm. you're gonna bring like 
summer clothes and I decided to bring my winter clothes and I didn't need them until like mid-September. Right. Unless mm -hmm. you're coming from afar, yeah. then obviously bring your stuff. Mm -hmm. But if mm -hmm. it's easy commute, like your parents can drive you up once in a while, then you don't need to bring everything. So that's it for our room tour. I highly recommend Living on Res. It's a great learning experience to make new friends. Alright, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed.